gosh, look at this. Mm. Mm. All right. Here we go. Sunday. Woke up at 4.30, had coffee, had some multivitamins, and then I fell back asleep for a little bit. Feeling a little, a little cooked for one reason or another. Not sure why. You know what do you wear? These polarized sunglasses? You can't see the screen of the camera. What's up with that? I know I keep you all attuned on, on my sleep. You know, I had another interesting sleep episode Friday night into Saturday. Woke up and I had to play uh, a bunch of sports for my church group, Olympics. And uh, gosh, it was, you know, when I get, when I get that bout of uh, off sleep, it just throws me off so much. It's really, it's, it makes things very difficult. It makes things very difficult. So the hunt continues for a resolution to that. And I go to bed, I go to bed consistently. 10:30 every night. Wake up at the same time. So we're doing we're doing the best we can over here. At any rate, we got a nice Sunday planned for y'all today. We're gonna go on a cruise to church. Perhaps hang out with some crew after that. Grab some nice lunch. And then I don't know what's gonna happen after that. I might go check out this local gym sign up for a week pass to try it out because I got to get back into the gym grind. I'm maintaining pretty well and that only lasts so long so <clears throat> we're gonna get back at it. Here we go. Look at this. It's a rare sight. Highway 35. This location with no traffic. It's a rare sight. Nice day today. Let's go have some fun shall we? Let's do it. Wouldn't mind living there because it's right next to this food truck. Last night I had cookies for dinner. It was a mistake. And you know what was worse? They weren't even that good. They didn't taste good. They were, they were just bland. It was like I was eating paper. You ever eat paper before? No good. Look at this joint. Quantos? Samataro. Wow. What's going on? Saw it, oh. Saw. Let me see here. Probably gonna do a little brisket today. Smoke, smoke, cheesy hash brown casserole. Are you serious right now? We're so serious, dude. I'm gonna have to give me some of that as a side. We'll do like a quarter pound of brisket. Uh, sounds good. Yeah, that's, that'll hit the spot right there. Who's Chopper? Fired up. Yeah, dude. What's happening? Just a BBQ, yeah. We got a little quarter pound brisket, and they got this new hash brown casserole. Oh, it's dude. looking real good. Ooh, um, favorite letters, bro. Yeah, <laughs> BBQ, HBC, hash brown casserole. Is that what you got? That's what I got. Folks, we got the hash brown casserole up in here. It's freaking ridiculous. And we got this barbecue meat right here. Dang, dude. I'm about to try it. Gosh, look at this. Mmm. 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 Mm. Oh, that right there. That's what we call a scrumptious treat. Mm. So ooey gooey hot. Melts in your mouth. Barbecue smoking goodness. Mm. This doesn't light you up. I don't know what this was. You gotta check out Rolling Smoke Barbecue on the east side. Location's prime. Plenty of seating. Mm. I don't even know what else to say. I'm speechless right now. This is just too good to be true. Try the bris brisket. Let me try this. Look at this fall off the bone brisket. Let's put it in the, in the sauce right here. Oh my. Lord have mercy. This is big red soda. Barbecue sauce. Big red soda. I bet you never had big red soda barbecue sauce before. That's because it's a rolling smoke barbecue staple. Mm. Just ate some amazing barbecue. Thank you so much, uh, Rolling Smoke Barbecue, for your inventive creations. Now we're in East Austin. 
like to take you through this a little bit of this neighborhood here with some really unique homes that uh, you know they're not cheap by any stretch of the imagination look we got some new construction down there this one's for sale looks like for lease and for sale and then you got something like this which is super modern and then you got something like this which is just I don't even know what's going on there old school classic right here you see what I'm saying? Yeah. Oh, and then you got that thing, which is barely standing up. Wouldn't be surprised if someone lives there, though. This is East Side Austin. Then you got, oh, here we go. Here we go. Yup. That's what's up right there. There you go. That's what's up. Love it. And then, bam! Downtown. What's up? What is this little house? Look how 70s that looks. And then you got that thing. What in the world is that? What is even that? I don't even know, but it's pretty cool. So, I mean, I don't know about you guys, but I think this is so cool that it's right, literally right here next to downtown Austin. There's all the hotels, or a lot of them, not all of them. Highway 35 right here. Let's go to a really cool place. It's called an auto lounge. An auto lounge. It's where people house their super sick exotic cars I don't know if they have them for sale I'm not sure we will find out though I, I came across my radar a couple days ago from Isaac on the team and I was like dude that is where it's at let's go